Hello. In this video, we demonstrate two-way ANOVA and in-way ANOVA. So we have the data membership. It has these variables. It has the duration in weeks for membership and whether the uh, subscriber or the customer has a plan or not, and the paid price, how much they paid for that plan, and also the area. And we have, like I think, three areas, A, B, and C. So in the code, um, in the code uh, area, I have prepared the um, the two-way ANOVA code. So it's PROC ANOVA, data equals, and this is the name of the library and then the data set. And then we would like to test this model that duration in weeks depends on the plan, the area, and the interaction between them. So this, these are three variables, three factors. The, they plan the area and the interaction between them. And then we hit the run button. And we get these results. This is the the sum. The first table shows that, that the plan has two levels, zero and one, and the area has three types, A, B, or C. And then it this tells us, the second table tells us that there uh, were 3,333 records read, but only 2,151 used. And this is the summary, the most important um, uh, table that, that assesses the model. If you remember, this is the model that says the duration depends on plan area and the interaction between them. So if we go to results, so the p-value is 0 0.6371. It's greater than the alpha of 0 0.05. This means that we cannot uh, reject the null hypothesis. And the null hypothesis states that uh, these are significant, like these three, these three factors are significant. So we conclude that they're not significant. That is, the duration of membership in weeks does not depend on plan area or plan and area together. And that's for the two-way because it has two variables. Now, if we want to add, if we go to membership, it has Oh, it doesn't have any other. So, yeah, we'll, we'll demonstrate the in-way ANOVA in another video.